Okay, we're on. Just let me, uh, send a thing to my Discord real quick. I'm now doing FNAF 2, everybody. Woohoo! Let's get fucking panic attacked again. Bonnie 
he's gone, I know exactly where he went. Where is the camera? I'm pretty sure. Yeah, it's... Yeah, it's this one. It's this one, okay. Yeah, his guitar is not with him either! There's been an update! There has obviously been an update that I'm completely unaware of. Yeah, see? He doesn't have his guitar. Yeah, see? He's right here now. Now he's gonna go to room two. Because when he's in camp three, he has his guitar. He doesn't have his guitar. What the fuck? Has there been an update? Or is it just different for console? Because I'm playing this on console. Oh, they're all gone. Instead of die. Oh, okay. I see. I see what you did. There we go. You just won the night. Yeah, I love the muffin song. <laughs> the muffin is my favorite character. I don't know why. Probably because he's so happy and constantly wants to kill himself. You know, by having people eat him. I guess we're just two or something. I don't know. Uh, hello? Hello? Uh, uh, yeah, my previous stream is downloading. Uh, and it is 4.1 gigabytes because it is uh, four uh, minutes of four fucking hours long. It's for BR and P 
see. Uh, fucking mangle! insomnia but they weren't completely sure until I did a sleep study like one of those where you go in I didn't had internet I was just playing phone games and universe sandbox yeah yeah cuz my mom wanted to figure out, because she tried getting me to sleep multiple times, and she couldn't without, like, NyQuil. Because it lasts your laptop and play that, yeah. Yeah, because one of the things that my mom struggled with was putting me to bed when I was a kid. So one day she said, fuck it, I'm taking my daughter to the doctor. So she did. And, uh, she was like, hey, my daughter has a hard time sleeping. Like, is there something I'm doing wrong or is there something medical about it? And they're like, oh, well, let us check. So they did, like, this weird eye thing to me where they checked, like, my eyes and shit. And they said they wouldn't 
know until I did a, like, a sleep study? I didn't know what that was, so I'm, I'm looking at my mom and I'm like, what's a sleep study? And she's like, where, it's where they keep you at a certain place for a certain amount of time and watch your sleep cycle. And I'm like, okay, doesn't sound that weird. Because to me, it really didn't sound that weird. So, and my mom was kind of iffy about it because she didn't know. She was a mama bear. She still is. She doesn't really like me in the hospitals for a long amount of time. Especially when she thinks I'm going to be okay. So, here's the thing. I don't know if it's in my medical records. Do they put that shit in your medical records? I hope they do. Then I can figure out how many of these fucking things I went on. Because, to my knowledge, I've probably been at, like, multiple. <laughs> I like the music. Eh, I don't really care for it. Fuck! Wrong button! I thought I could switch it in time! I thought I could switch it in time! Damn it! I was so close! And I like that you're getting scared. Yeah, har har! Really funny, Lissaja! Yeah. So I did like, fucking, what, three? Two sleep studies? I hated it. I didn't get scared at all. Yeah, okay. And it was just one of those things where I'm like, oh, fucking, why do I do this? Like, why do you watch me sleep? Because if, like, the first time I was okay, I was kind of confused because, you know, I was like, what? Oh, fuck, I think I was like, no, I wasn't 10 because 10 years old was near the time where I got uh, an infection. I want to VR. Yeah, fuck you. No thanks. I want to do this shit in order, thank you very much. Yeah, and I thought it was really weird at first, and then like, oh my second one, I believe, is when I was going like, okay, this is really fucking creepy. I wish you were playing though. I can't, because I don't have the money! Okay? I don't have the fucking money. That, I'm still learning how to use my PC, so... Sorry. Like, seriously, dude. That was actually one of the things I hated as a kid was going to the doctors. Okay, listen, ja, I understand that it would probably scare the shit out of me, but here's the thing. I don't have the money! And not only that, but I'm still learning how to use my computer for other things. This is just nothing playing in VR is a scary experience. I'm blatantly aware of that, thank you. I really feel like you're trying to push me into playing it. Even though I'm trying to do these games in chronological order. At least to my knowledge. Or at least by release date. In, in my opinion, I'm doing this by release date. Mangle, you fuck. 
fucking cunt? Can you just leave? Or at least come here and try to scare me so that way I can just put my helmet on and tell you to go fuck off. Really? Hey, Bonnie! Or do you prefer Bon Bon? Hey, Foxy. Sorry if you're epileptic. came in and I was so pissed. Really? Great! Gamer guy's here! Hey, any of y'all like gamer guy? I call him gamer guy for a very specific reason. Oh, I hope I was quick enough! <coughs> I don't think I was! Oh my god. Chica, I hope Foxy takes you back to Parks and Service. Really, Mangle? Thank you. Also, I thought Mangle was the right bend. Wait, no, that is the right bend. Oh, there we go. Now I won. I don't think you can do Five Nights. 
Honestly, I couldn't do Five Nights at Freddy's 1, Night 5, so I doubt I can do this one. It'd probably stress me out. Like, I had a fucking panic attack that night, okay? A panic attack. So can you blame me? Fuck no. This is easier than the next one. Well, I hope so. Hedgehog, that shit. <sighs> Let's do this again.
talk to you again. Scare 
Bowser's in that one. Go fucking figure, because Bonnie was the last animatronic I had to deal with. Oh, great. Here's this cutscene again. Their eyes should be blacked out. Yep. Their eyes are blacked out. Their mouths are wide open. Hi, Golden Freddy. Yeah, see? I'm staring you in the eyes, motherfucker. You two-souled bitch! That's right, I know your secret! You had two motherfuckers in that suit! It's me. Yeah, no shit! Alright, here we go! Who's gonna fuck me over this time? Probably Foxy, probably Foxy. Who's gonna fuck me over this time? Probably Foxy's ass. successfully turned one of the motherfuckers away. 
it up. I think. soon. Shit. I was actually really close. I was really close. I had like a full, like not full battery, but like a full bar. So Bloom Boy's close by. Probably an event. Doing good, doing good. 
late with Chica. <laughs> yep. Yep. I was late. Constantly. Constantly late. Constantly late. Looking at me all sad. Kita, no, Kita, Kita. That's a headset, not a chew toy. I'm wearing a headset, not, not a chew toy, not a chew toy. Just get that clear. Let's try this shit again. Go up water. Continue button. <sighs> Is this gonna happen every single fucking time I play any FNAF game? I just get stuck on the fourth night, and just fifth night gives me panic attacks. Fuck off! 
Foxy? I wasn't paying attention to the holes. Yeah, it's just Foxy. Couple seconds, there we go. Ah, great, that bitch moved. So she's there. Oh, well, I think Fox. Is Mangle a she? Oh, shit. Bonnie moved. Not there, though. Mangle is in the hallway, I think. Foxy, can you? I don't know. Fuck off, please. Okay, now I just have to be sparing because it's like, what the fuck? What the fuck? Notification on my Discord. It says I downloaded shit. What the fuck? I might get jump scared. Dismiss. Thank you. I don't know why the fuck it's telling me to. Oh shit, shit, shit. There we go. I don't know why it was telling me to download news shit. I don't even pay attention to the news. I literally go fuck you to the news anytime I go. Because honestly, I don't really care for news outlets. They're interesting and all when something really important's happening, but everything else is just really confusing to me. Imagine doing this in real life. Honestly, if this happened in real life, I'm pretty sure the government would have closed this shit down. The government would have just went, you know what, fuck you, we don't appreciate this, we don't appreciate what you're building, William Afton, come with us, you're going to fucking jail. And also, why the fuck do you even exist, you're orange and you're purple? Why the fuck do you two exist? <laughs> fucking interrupting me! Fuck you, Bonnie! You interrupted me, you dick! Jeez, I was trying to say shit. <laughs> you fucking kidding me? <laughs> oh my god, this shit's really starting to piss me off. Like, I'm not even scared anymore. I'm just getting pissed. Like, if this shit was in reality, we would have shut this shit down by now. Like, this restaurant chain has broken so many laws. Like, there's so many laws being broken in this game. It's just unridic- It's, like, super, super ridiculous. Cause, first of all... <laughs> how the fuck do they even manage the copyright for this shit? Second of all, I'm pretty sure this shit breaks a fuck ton of health codes. Oh, yes, well, our animatronics wander around at night. Oh, you're probably breaking a lot of, uh, I, I don't know, uh, health violations, uh, physical violations towards people around you. Uh, I don't know. Hello. Ill business practice? Like, there's so many laws. So many laws being broken in one place is ridiculous. Like, I've never seen so many laws being broken in one fucking fell swoop. It's so stupid. One, two, three, four. One, two, three, four, five. Here we go. Hi. Yeah, because... As much as I love this game and the aspect of just like animatronics coming to kill you and shit like that, uh, this breaks so many laws. <laughs> like for one, this must be a licensing nightmare. Like to license not only the animatronics, 
but every single piece of merchandise that this company owns must be a fucking paperwork hellscape. Like, I'm not even joking. Oh, great. I think I busted my headset because my... Oh, my fucking god, of course. Okay, the headset actually does something because they back off a little bit. Yeah, because... Think of it. Posters, plushies, fucking toys, TVs, songs, all that has to have certain paperwork to be copyrighted properly. Just imagine the paperwork fucking nightmare this company has to go through. And not only that, but the illegal shit that's going on in the behind the scenes. Like, these animatronics cannot be up to code. Even the toy ones don't even look up to code. Like, oh, yes, these are the toy animatronics. Okay, um, sir, they cannot have specific assets such as, uh, I don't know, these teeth! Most animatronics, their teeth have to be super fucking thin. These teeth on these animatronics are like fucking blocks. And not only that, but they have the capability to move around off stage. Not only does that cause a lot of health risk shit, but the paperwork and the lawyers needed to actually permit this shit must be absolutely insane. Like, don't even get me fucking started on their pizza. Cause if the animatronics are moving around, they must be getting into the kitchen. <laughs> They move only at night. Well, sure, they move only at night, but that's still the thing. They move. They are. They shouldn't even be outside of their little restricted zone where they have, like, the whole entire pizza diner or whatever. The fucking dining space. Because normally, animatronics are respected specifically in the dining area where the stage is, so that way any, like, Loose oil, scrap, pieces of hair from their felt-covered bodies would normally protect them. Well, all that is probably going to end up in your pizza. Or in your cola. Or in, I don't know, whatever the fuck you're eating. So they're breaking a lot of fucking health codes, just moving away from where they are. So if they're moving away from where they are, they're breaking a lot of fucking health violations. This is like health violation to heaven. You want to find a place to report a motherfucker? You go to Freddy Fazbear's. Just look inside their restaurant. You're going to find a shit ton of health code violations. Because if a health inspector buys a pizza and they find yellow fur from Chica, because we all know Chica likes to go in the kitchen... So if they find, like, even a tiny error, like a tiny, teeny, teeny error in anything, they're going to use that against you, and they're going to go, Hey, I found this shit. I'm writing you up. You do not want that shit on your record. You really do not, especially if you're trying to own a restaurant. Because if you're trying to own a restaurant, and you have, like, one single health code violation from any place you worked at, that's going to affect the restaurant you're building. Okay, 5 a.m. Let's do this. Apparently talking business really works. Because <laughs> I've actually studied what health inspectors have to do in order, you know, because during culinary you have to study a lot of shit. I wanted to be ahead of people, so I started uh, studying shit, like, way, like, way ahead of my class. Like, I'm not even supposed to be studying certain shit because of certain shit. And yet, I was. Because I wanted to. And because I thought it was smart of me. And because I thought it was cool. So I decided to study the qualifications for a health care. <laughs> Fuck you, chica, for interrupting me! Then I was at 5 a.m. and I'm still pissed about it. Because health inspectors are assholes. <laughs> They're doing their job. They're doing their job. But they're assholes. <laughs> I need to get more water. So, if you have 
you, you can literally ask any health, health inspector buddy. You can literally ask them. They're assholes. They have to report any, like, any little thing. Like, every little thing, they're gonna report. Like, anything. Sorry if my trigger goes crazy. I have my remote in my pocket. I'm getting water. Because I want to continue talking. So, say you're owning a business and you have, like, two strikes. Because I actually looked this up. And you could look it up, too. Sometimes health inspectors are nice. And they'll, like, give you, like, tiny written-ups. Like, small things. And they'll just come back later and help you fix it. Those are, like, strikes. So, if you have multiple strikes. Like, multiple small shit on what you've done, you can't really own a business because they'll see you as a liability. And if you're a liability, you can't have a business because A, you're a liability, and B, being a liability means you're most likely going to screw up. And in the restaurant industry, you cannot screw up. Like, a single fuck up can really ruin your restaurant. Whether it's messing up and some actually having an allergen in their food, such as shrimp, peanuts, peppers, and yes, people can be allergic to peppers, you can literally get sued and be put on your rap sheet and be seen as a slight ability. But if it's something as big as them finding rats in your restaurant, finding hair in their food, like finding odd substances near drinking stations, that will get you written up. The reason of no one joining the Discord is they didn't leave, you didn't leave a link, an invite link. How do I do that? Like, I have the Triple Leaders uh, Discord thing, like, in the name bar. I, I don't know how else I'm supposed to do it. I really don't. Alright, so let me stop my bickering and continue night four. <coughs> so, yeah. One fuck up can really ruin your chances of owning a restaurant or anything. And I know this because I'm going to college for culinary. I have to study this shit. Because one fuck up can really ruin your career. So, yeah. This entire game <laughs> is super unrealistic. Like, the murder thing, yeah, that might be a little realistic because serial killers can get away with shit for decades. Like, take the Zodiac Killer, for instance. Like, that motherfucker hasn't been found. And his latex codex was a bitch slap to investigator's face. <coughs> he could be fucking dead for all we know, the Zodiac Killer. So, this, uh, killing kids shit, it, it's kind of realistic, yeah. It's kind of realistic. But as for, like, this being a restaurant? Uh, <laughs> yeah. No. Just no. I think... Will I be able to leave a link in the, ch in the chat through my computer? I think I, I will be able to. Hello. But, uh, yeah. And... <laughs> like, this is a paradise for health inspectors. Like, this is like a right-up paradise. Because, believe it or not, they actually get a bonus for things that they write up on. It, it may not be seen on paper, but it's seen in reality. Because, ask your local health inspector, Hey, do you get a bonus every single time you sign somebody up? And they'll go, oh, fuck yeah. Because... It really depends on what the write-up actually is. Like, if it's a very, like, bad write-up, like, you have a rat infestation, uh, someone's being extremely unhygienic in your restaurant, uh, if, for instance, right now, these animatronics are moving around in the middle of the night near your kitchen, that's an extreme write-up. Oh, thank you. Thank you for putting the Discord link. I still am trying to figure this shit out. Because... That's like one of the big things. You cannot, you cannot, if you have animatronics in your store, in your restaurant, you cannot let them be moving around. Just no. Mm -mm. Absolutely fucking not. You cannot let them be moving around because there's a likelihood they'll enter the kitchen. Once they enter the kitchen, 
everything out of the kitchen, whether it's out of the freezer, out of the refrigerator, out of the spice cabinet, all of it will be counted as contaminated goods. And you absolutely fucking do not want contaminated goods in your restaurant. Because not only is it a health risk, but it is a likelihood of a lawsuit. Because let's say uh, someone's using your freezer as a break room. Extremely stupid, extremely unhygienic, but I've heard of it happening. So if someone's using... <laughs> Fuck you, chick, for interrupting me. So if someone's using your freezer, like where you keep all your frozen goods, your sodas, all of that, because, yeah, you can keep your sodas in a freezer in a restaurant. Trust me, y you can. Like, if you do that, that person, unless they went through a fucking sanitizer pool, they'll be counted as contamination. And your entire freezer will be counted as contaminated goods. No animatronic touches food. They don't have to. You don't have, okay, so you know how when you're at a restaurant and, oh shit, fucking wrong button. So you know when you're at a restaurant and sometimes you'll find a food, like a little strand of hair in your food. Th guess what? People don't have to touch your food in order for the hand, like that single gross ass hair to land in your food. Like, it doesn't take that much to get like hair in your food. It doesn't take that much for like saliva because when you talk, you spit. You know, oh, -doo 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 -doo, I'm talking right now and I'm spitting everywhere. You know, not like in a gross manner. Like every single word you say, like vapor is going into the air. And that also counts as contaminant. So these animatronics, see the old ones? Those are felt. Like it's so obvious that that's felt. So these old animatronics are rummaging around. Like, they're walking around with their felt-covered asses. And you can hear it from not only the phone guy, but also in previous other games, that these animatronics have an odor. Hi. So it's obvious that they have a little something-something uh, in them. So even if they even entered the room, not only would that smell be there, but the hair from their felt-covered bodies would. Which is a bad thing. Like, extremely fucking bad. Like, ridiculously bad. So, for them not being able to touch the food, that's not a matter of opinion, okay? You don't have to touch food for it to be contaminated. If your hair is not in a hairnet, for example, because if you have hair longer than, like, pa about past your earlobe is usually when... You have to have a hairnet. There's a reason, because that hairnet catches any hair follicle that comes off your head. And I mean any hair follicle. Like you could put it on your nuts and not a single strand of hair is gonna go on anybody. And the thing is, they're obviously not gonna wear protective gear when it comes to going into different rooms. So, their felt, which is hair, because if you look at this, you see the molding? That's a base for felt. So, their felt is getting all over the food, and they don't have to touch it. Like, they don't have to put a finger on any of the food, because guess what? Their felt is already in it. And I don't mean in it, I mean like, like plastered on it. Like, that's where the felt is gonna land. It's gonna land on, like, any exposed drink, any exposed pizza. Unless it's, like, securely plastic wrapped, it's definitely going on anything that isn't properly taken care of or placed in a container. So this is just, like, health code heaven right here. Like, health code violation heaven. And not only that, but I bet you, I and I bet my top dollar that the exposed wires are basically going to spark anywhere you see. Because, 
and I pet this. <laughs> Them keeping these animatronics and parts and service is already a violation. Because look, see? Look at all those wires that are exposed. Just one fucking spark off Bonnie there could light this place ablaze. Like anything partially exposed is just automatic fire. <laughs> Like this, this place has so many fucking hazards. Oh my gosh, it's so bad. Okay, I'm at 3 a.m. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. I'm doing good. I need to check them. Yep, I'm glad I checked the music box. I was too slow again. Please, please. I was as fast as I could be. Okay, good, good, good. I hate you, Chica. Go suck a cock. Oh wait, you can't, cause your jaw's broken. Also, how the fuck did Chica break her jaw? How'd she do that? Like, I could probably guess how Bonnie lost his face. I could probably guess that, but how did she... How did Chica break her jaw? Like, how? Can someone explain to me? Like, can someone please give me an explanation on how exactly? Because I honestly want to know, like, what does it take to, for an animatronic to break their jaw to the point where it looks like that? Because that is freaky as shit, man. It's like, oh, I got it. Fuck! Please, 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 please. Phew! Okay. Oh, well, someone was in the vent. Don't know who, but they were in the vent. Okay, Foxy's still there. Never mind, it looks like he's leaving. <laughs> Chica's looking a little sad at me. Chica, I'll take you out. Not Chica. Fuck! Hey, Freddy! You fucking cop! Right when I say cock, Chica appears. Great! Great! Wait, does that mean Chica's a rooster? Is Chica a rooster? Chica, bam. Chica, are you a rooster? That'd be surprising. Chica was actually not just a chicken, but a rooster. Oh shit. Okay, I'm doing good. Be gone. Listen, I'm not in the mood for this shit. Hi! Hi, Prowl! Powell 2K9. Hi, Mangle. Hello, how are you? Won the night! Kitty, okay, do you wanna go outside? Kid has to go outside. Oh, hey puppet! How are you? How are you? What is your name again, Charlotte? The the person inside your animatronic body. It's Charlotte, right? I can't remember. I haven't caught up on anything. Salty I'm guessing that's trying to say salty unknown. Hi, salty unknown, how are you? Uh, the marionette looks pretty fine. It's me. I'm gonna take that as a yes, my name is Charlotte. Night five! Puppet is not an animatronic. Yeah, that always confused me. <laughs> I was always confused about that. Like, am sh is Puppet animatronic, or is it an actual puppet? Like, what's, what's up with it? Good, what about you? I'm doing pretty good. Uh, 
Yeah, I know all about that. I was just confused because I'm pretty sure Matt had discovered the name of the child already, right? Like the name being Charlotte. I don't remember. I need to catch up on those. <laughs> like, how many videos have Matt Pat made? Like, I love the game theory. They're awesome. Like, they're really awesome. I, I need to get caught up on all that shit. I don't know the name. I'm pretty sure it's Charlotte? Charlotte or Charlie? I can't remember. It's one of those two. Because I've read all the ebooks on this. Uh, you know, Silver Eyes, that kind of thing. Although, they kind of confused me a bit. I was late! I was so late. Go ahead and check out. There she is. Yeah. Elizabeth is Golden Freddy. Oof. Elizabeth? Huh. I'm gonna have to look that up, is that? Hmm. No, wait! Cassidy! Cassidy is the name for Golden Freddy. Yeah, okay, I'm starting to remember now. I'm starting to remember. Because, if I remember correctly, and I'm going off by uh, Matt Pat's research, um, Cassidy is Golden Freddy. Jeremy is Bon... Wait, no, is Jeremy Bonnie or Foxy? I can't remember. I did give you... Oh, thank you! Thank you! I really appreciate it. I'm still growing and shit, so I'm still learning. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, it's actually six, not five. Alright. No problem. Thank you! Yeah. I figured as much. Like, I don't know why. It does sound like a little boy if you think about it at the same time. It kind of does sound like a little boy, but it also sounds more feminine. Because usually my go-to for information on FNAF... I've seen, like, many websites try to, you know, do all that shit, but eh. Everyone forgets about me, but it's okay. Oh, I'm sorry, hon. It's okay, Lissaja. I'm trying to remember... Cause, um... Susie was the name for Chica. Okay, I remember... Okay, Susie is Chica. Cassidy is... Cassidy's Golden Freddy. Jeremy is either Fox or Foxy or Bonnie. I'm trying to remember the other names. Fucking Mangle. I don't appreciate your presence at all. I can't remember. Is it Charlie or Charlotte? It's one of those for the puppet. I know it is. I'm not... I'm not fibbing on that one. I know it's either Charlotte or Charlie. I, I can't bloody remember. You just... I will look later back in. You just did that too. <laughs> well, I've kind of been, uh, you know, focused. <laughs> I got you. Nice. Mangle, can you do me a favor and go away, please? Thank you. Mangle's such a pain. Hello. Bloom boy, I'm not in the mood. Oh, fuck! I was late! <laughs> go ahead, Chica. Yep. Just as I thought. Okay, just let the dog back in. Fuck! 
I was late that time as well. God damn it. Uh, whatever. Still. All right. Let me sit back down real quick. Continue. Here we go. And now that I got a laptop, I can do this until I complete it. <sighs> okay. This honestly is kind of easy. Hmm. Because I know that, uh, Golden Freddy. I watched a map episode recently because I was trying to rewatch all of them in order, like in order of upload. I'm like, huh, because I saw one with uh, Golden Freddy on the front with like two souls from Soul Eater, Hello. and I was like, huh, what in the world is this episode? And it was a discussion about how Golden Freddy could have like two souls, and I'm like, the hell? Is that even possible? And uh, yeah, I watched that entire episode, and I'm like, holy shit, they have a point. <laughs> Because it kind of makes sense. Like, if I'm thinking about it, it kind of makes sense. Because I can't remember who the other soul he guessed was. I'm pretty sure it was Crying Child. But, uh... It was pieced together that uh, Cassidy was the name for Golden Freddy. And I was like, holy shit. This motherfucker cracked it. <laughs> Like, he cracked the case wide open. Come on. Oh, shit. I was late. <laughs> I was late. <laughs> yep, I was late. <sighs> I'm not quick, okay? Like, I'm not very quick at this. I'm not very spidey. I'm not a speedy, speedy gal. Oh lordy, all right. This is bullshit. I really gotta pee. I'll be right back. I gotta do something real quick. unknown for figuring this out. Okay, so Freddy is Gabriel. Bonnie is Jeremy. Chica... Okay, so I know Chica was uh, Susie. Foxy was Fritz. Okay. Foxy was Fritz. Cassidy was Gold Golden Freddy. And then... Sh okay, Charlotte. Alright. I thought it was Charlie for a second. Thank you, Salty Unknown. You are a big brain. Holy shit. Nice! Okay. Nice. I, I, I'm actually very, very pleased. Very pleased. 
Alright, let me just, there we go. Had to do something real quick. Okay. Hey, Charlotte! I'm winding up your music box. No, it's because of Golful. Oh! Well, still, thank you for getting that information for me. I really appreciate it. Still very big brain. And very big heart. Alright. Wind, 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 wind. Fuck off, Fretz! Oh, great. You brought fucking Jeremy with you. Okay. Jeremy went back a bit. Bloom Boy, because Bloom Boy just moved. Listen, Jeff, with the three dots. Dot, dot, dot. I don't like that noise. You can fuck right off. Balloon boy. Oh, well, I sent someone back into the vent. Oh, shit. Sorry, Charlotte. Sorry. Have you. S f f fuck, I was late. Have you still read my other messages? Yes, I have. I have read your other messages. <laughs> fuck. Baby and innard are self aware animatronics. Well, not entirely. Because I know Baby is controlled by William Afton's daughter, Elizabeth. Because I'm, I'm very fond of Five Nights at Freddy's sister location. And Baby is controlled by a spirit named Elizabeth. While good old... Yeah, Scoopa. <laughs> Scoopa. And uh, Ennard, who is technically... Um... Funtime Freddy, Funtime Foxy, and Ballora, all those guys were made with Remnant. Which is kind of like a soul metal shit. Like, enchanted soul shit. And they're basically like all the originals, so all the, f like, I'm gonna say five? Or was it four? Because I know it was the endos of Freddy, Bonnie, Foxy, and Chica, but I can't remember if Golden Freddy was in the mix. I'm pretty sure not. And they were like melted together into Remnant. Follow for you in a bit. Oh, thank you. Like, I'm pretty sure that uh, they do have a soul. I just can't remember if it was like... Does it count? I'm pretty sure Remnant counts as a soul. Because it's like Hello. soul metal goo. So, yeah, Baby does have a soul. Lysia, I'm still here. I know, Han. How are you, Lysia? You doing good? Or am I forgotten? You're not forgotten, Han. Shit, shit, shit. Aww! Thank you for being so nice to listen to just Salty Unknown. Discord, the Triple Leaders Discord, and Lissajo was my first ever member. Like, Lissajo is a chill dude. I 
I will post about my new Discord all over my social media. I just haven't gotten to it. Sorry, Lissaja. <laughs> Fuck! Well, that spooked me. <laughs> Shit! Okay. <sighs> Fuck, that got me. <laughs> Shit. Actually, now that you mentioned it, I'll actually do that right now. Can you make a link that lasts forever? With Discord, cause that would be dope. Okay, let me go to the Discord real quick. Also, people are telling me that Discord has like a new thing. Let's ju Okay. Thank you, dude. Hmm. Can you invite me? It's right there. Yeah, I'm working on getting the link right now. Link copied, there we go. Oh shit, 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 shit! Woo! That was close! And it's permanent. Nice! I just got the link. Oh my god, I've hit so many, so many, so many close calls. I'm not joking. Alright. First up, Instagram. Okay, okay, okay. Fucking, oh, Jesus Christ! Scared the shit out of me! pins in your clipboard. Yeah, same here. I'm constantly, like, copying a lot of links and shit. Shit, shit, shit. Fucking balloon boy. Nope, 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 nope. I'd rather not. Shit, 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 shit. Woo! That was close. Fuck! <laughs> hurt my throat. Oh, that hurt my throat really bad. Ow. Oh, fuck. That that hurt. <laughs> that really fucking hurt. Ooh. Ooh. Okay, there we go. I hate Bonnie so much. Oh my god. Oh, I just got a thing right here. You slid into the Discord. Hey, welcome to the Discord. Noise. Yeah, but like this is like so cool. Oh my god. Can I just rant about Bonnie real quick? I fucking hate Bonnie. What the fuck do? Like jeez, I did not fucking expect that shit. <laughs> I didn't. I really honestly I didn't. I really honestly didn't. I didn't expect that at all. That's so stupid. That's stupid in a million fucking ways. Okay. Whew, okay. Let's start this again. While I'm also making a post on my Instagram because I'm that stupid. Okay. Okay, Mangle's moving quick. That's, uh... Something I didn't want to see, but okay.
fucking balloon boy! Yeah, fab I can't. It's like my non-existent dick. I really hope this doesn't give me a panic attack. Like, I can tell this is probably gonna give me a fucking panic attack, and I don't want it to. I'm hoping that overcharging it will, like, delay it a bit. But honestly, I don't think that's doing the trick. <gasps> fucking! Damn it, I was late again! Ugh, fuck. <laughs> yep, see? Late. Shit. <coughs> fuck. Okay. Great. Why do I always get scared? I always get scared, period. I don't want to hear it. Like, I'm trying to figure out how to edit this. Yeah, because Bonnie... Ugh, Bonnie's a dick. Let's just get it fucking out there. Bonnie is a dick. He's a big old dick. No one wants to deal with. Oh, my God. I'm just so irritated right now. I'm so fucking irritated. Alright. Oh, fuck. Hey, Foxy. I'm getting scared every time you get jump scared. Well, I'm pretty sure that's the point of jump scares. <laughs> something I was yapping my gums off about was fucking health code violations. No one wants to hear that shit, Justice. And yet you said it anyway. What the fuck? I was late again. God fucking damn it. Prepare for a jump scare! <laughs> there it is. Me. Please. Vent repair. Also me. Throws myself outside the window. Got scared again. <laughs> Sorry. Yeah, that happened. Oh my god, I fucking hate this shit. Anyone else hate this shit? <laughs> Cause I do. I fucking do. I hate this. I hate this. I'm starting to get really pissed off at this. Like, this is so stupid. <sighs> okay. I need to make a goddamn game plan. Like, what am I supposed to do? You know? Mm -hmm. 
Like, ah, fuck. FNAF 2 is hard. Me plays FNAF 1, also me shoots with. Jeez, Lizzie FNAF 2 is hard. It was hard to, like, this night. Alright. 11 animatronics. Yeah. Yeah, I had a panic attack at FNAF 1 on night 5. So, for my own health and safety, I stopped playing it. Like, all together. And I just, I had to curl up in a ball. You good? You finally- No, you're not good. <laughs> if FNAF help wanted, it's warning you not to play. Yeah, it literally gives you a warning. <laughs> Like, it's like, hey, you might not want to play this if you're weak of heart. But guess what? I'm weak of heart. Here I am. Oh, for fuck's sake. Oh, shit, 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 shit. Run, 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 run. Fuck. Okay. Shit! I accidentally scared the dog! Oh no, Kita, I'm sorry, honey. She, like, came right over to me. <laughs> like, when I show any signs of anxiety, she'll, like, try to stop me from doing whatever I'm doing. <laughs> What's unlocks? What? Yo. What? Look down the hallway seeing Foxy terrifying. <laughs> terrifying you what? <laughs> Kita, no, that's my headset, honey. You can't eat that. Wait, so I can have this? Trophies will be disabled. No! You play with my heart. Aw oh, man! Aw, oh, that would have been that would have made things so much easier. Oh my god, that would have made things so much easier! But no one had to turn off trophies! But that's the thing I want to get! Oh, you gotta be kidding me, man. radar map. I can't because it'll disable trophies. This will disable all trophies. See? Trophies disabled. Like, I want the trophies. Damn. Man, that's so stupid. There, I'm almost done. Almost. There we go. Okay. Even fast nights? Let me let me see. Yep, even fast nights. Fast nights, trophies disabled, that just trophies disabled, trophies disabled. Fuck, man, that's so stupid.
there, I put one in my Insta. Now let's work on getting it on my Twitter. Twitter, Twitter, Twitter. I'm getting this on my social medias. Yeah. Let's try this again. Because I have to fuck up everything. This is so stupid. So stupid. I hate it. Because it's so stupid. There is unlimited power no matter what. Yeah. I've noticed. I don't know. Probably for like game like other gaming purposes. I don't know. Like I know it's fucking you. Hi. Fucking balloon boy, you dickhead. Is he gone yet? I don't care, I have to fucking wind the music box. <laughs> Fuck! <gasps> the next stream. One, two, three. Hi, I'm new. Welcome! <laughs> I just got jump scared by Foxy. Oh, shit. Oh, my God. I just got jump scared, like, to the fucking moon from Foxy. Are you kidding me? I hate, I hate, I hate, I hate so much. I hate it so much. Okay, let's try this again. I really fucking failed that time, didn't I? I failed so miserably. Like, miserably isn't even the fucking right term for it! I feel bad, but it's also hilarious. I would feel the same way, okay? Like, I was like that for fucking Jacksepticeye and Markiplier, so I know what you mean. Guess what time it is for me? Bedtime? I don't know. Your time right- Your time right now if I'm not- Oh, man. I don't wanna know. Oh, for fuck's sakes. I mean, it's tw oh, it's 12 a.m. where you are. <coughs> Damn. Ooh. Did you get it? Yeah, I get it. Foxy's gonna be up your ass, that's for sure. Cause he's up mine! <laughs> oh my gosh, he truly is really up mine, isn't he? Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, there he is. He's gone, he's gone, he's gone. It's 6.45 for me. Uh, it is 7.45 for me. It is 7.45 p.m. for me right now. Someone's in the vents. Balloon boy! Why are you still here? Fucking go away! Oh, thank you. That was so close. <gasps> fucking, 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 fucking.
me breathe for a Sorry. Sorry for my intense fucking breathing, but I kind of need to do it right now. Whew. Okay. Dream, are you still here? <laughs> Probably not after that scream I just made. <sighs> okay. That was nice, wasn't it? Yeah. Let's get jump scared some more. Fuck reality. Reality's fake. It's a fraud. Hi. Oh my gosh. Listen, Jay, you're going nuts, my man. We're in a damn marathon. <laughs> oh my gosh. Well, he's closer now. Hello. Yeah, I got the joke. Okay, have my button on the trigger. Oh, that was quick! Oh, I'm speed! <laughs> After that shit, I hope I am. That was speed. Ooh, I did it again. I hate highs. <laughs> either because honestly that's what I do I got jump scared too oh, oh no you got jump scared as well I'm so sorry sugar oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh oh my gosh oh Megan welcomed you that's a great yay Megan welcomed you to the server Fuck. <laughs> I love it. Alyssa just joining you in on it. Nice. I was late. I was late. Prepare for a jump scare, bitches. Scared. <laughs> Shit. God damn it. Oh well. 
whatever. <laughs> Oh, fuck me. All right. Whew, I'm getting jump scared more often. Fucking great. Isn't that just awesome? That Bonnie cunt. Yeah. Bonnie's a cunt. Hey, Bonnie, you're a mega cunt! You can suck my cunt for all I care. Jeez! Yeah, my brother was here earlier today. He played, a uh, Because I have Fallout 4, and he is obsessed with the game. Yeah, fucking bitch. Ha 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 ha! One, two, three, four, five. Yeah, it's just Foxy. Okay, focus. Bot's warning. Fuck, fix my CPU, cause the jump scare broke it. Yeah, jump scares break everything. I've been playing this for like two hours and I'm on night five. That's amazing. Great. Balloon boy is on his way. first try. Elsa's not my enemy. I just want to make that fucking clear right now. He's not my enemy. I don't see Alt as an enemy of mine. I really don't. He actually did it. Cool. I congratulate him on that. But I just want to make something really clear right now that Alt is not my enemy. I don't see him as an enemy. Honestly. I just see him as a kid who likes to stream. And I can see, kid, because he's younger than me. <laughs> like, he's reminding me of his age multiple times. So... Really, Bonnie? He did it in hard mode. <laughs> I... I'm 11. Ah. Yeah. I'm 20, <laughs> turning 21 next year. So, that's why I try to tell people, fuck, I was late again. God damn it. Yeah, I try to tell people, hey, I don't make child friendly <laughs> shit because I'm not childhood friendly. I'm not child friendly at all. I swear like a pirate. Like, every fucking time I do. And it's just like, bleh. What the fuck? I just don't fucking get it. <laughs> it's so stupid. And also, why the fuck does it matter that people swear? Like, I wanna know. Like, I don't get it at all. Oh, that person swore! We must tell the children not to watch this! Uh, bitch, are you aware that almost every fucking child I know swears like a sailor? <laughs> but man, I don't act like it. And he, he did night six in two tries, yeah. Help wanted. 
I know Segs and I'm 11. I'm 13. Yeah, see? Because here's the thing. I don't understand why people are trying to protect their kids from swearing when, in all honesty, like, the youngest person I know who swears like a pirate is a 10-year-old. <coughs> I know about the thing that you said since I was nine. Yeah. Fuck is Balloon Boy. I started swearing at eight. I started swearing, like the first swear word I ever said was a uh, fuck. And the first adult thing that I did was, I saw my dad flip off someone. I think I was like, fuck. I'm pretty sure I was seven or something like that. Seven or like six maybe. And we were riding on my, uh, we were riding on a four wheeler that my neighbor had. I was about eight when I knew about sex. Yeah. <laughs> I knew about sex at a way younger age. I don't want to talk about that. But uh, the first thing I ever did that was any like sort of adult when I was like five. Yeah, same here. Like when I was a kid, I saw my dad flip off somebody and while we were on my neighbor's uh, four wheeler, me, my mom, well actually no, I think it was actually my neighbor's tractor we were on. Uh, I saw our landlord and I flipped him off because my dad flipped somebody off and I thought I was saying hi. My mom literally like stopped the tractor, I'm pretty sure it was a tractor, and was like, sweetheart, you don't do that, that's a bad thing, that's a really bad thing. And I started crying and apologizing to our landlord and he just looked at me and was like, who taught you that young lady? Where'd you learn that from? And I mentioned my dad doing it in the car with me and my brother. Mind you, my brother's like a year younger than me, so he was probably like about four or five. Hello. And my mom was like furious. She's like, you do not ride with your father anymore, that's for sure. I was like laughing my ass off. <coughs> but I said my first swear before my sixth birthday. The heck was that? I don't know. One, two, three, four, five. Oh, great! It's the fucking withered Freddy. Great, great. Da, 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 da. Fuck you, Freddy! Fucking hate that guy. <laughs> Fuck! Shit! Damn it! God fucking damn it! All right. I feel my heart rate rising, so I'm gonna take a break. <laughs> I'm gonna stop the stream and continue it tomorrow. <laughs> Fucking Gabriel! Ah. <laughs> Ooh, I was on my fucking tippy toes because of Gabriel and goddamn Jeremy scared me. Oh my god, okay. I'll see you. <laughs> When I said my first bad word, no one has swear, was when I was five and my mom slapped me when I said it. Bye, see ya. Yeah, goodbye. I need to do something to lower my heart rate. I'll see y'all later.